Welcome back friends, followers and transients to another episode of Empires of the Undergrowth with me and Vapor and we are going to do the Formicarium challenge. So um, what I did is I did the um, the challenge mode on the subjugation. I did that off camera because I said it's exactly the same as normal but with the mole crickets. A bit like what we just did in the, uh, in the previous episode here so there's no point me doing that again. But we're going to do this. Um, just let me quickly check one thing. Uh, so we're at maximum population. We still have a bit of expansion room if we want to. And we have some royal jelly. But I don't think. Is there anything? We've got 169. That one's going to cost me 150. But I don't need that just yet anyway. And I can't have that because I'm not level 2. But if we have a look in here. Increase attack speed by 20%. Or reduce me incoming damage. Well, let's go for higher attack speed and upon dropping below 40% health retreat for 5 seconds when out of combat regenerate 4 extra health per second hmm I think we might go for self preservation I don't know how quickly they heal but um, it seems like a good idea I don't think they're going to get to our queen so I'm not going to spend anything on those um do, 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 do. whilst not in combat attack so get, okay Right, <laughs> prepare yourself. This, this, this is fun. I mean, I've not played it on medium level yet, but it was fun on easy. And I say fun; it was a little bit challenging the first time. I think I died, if I remember rightly. But let's uh, let's give it a go. I think it is time we connected the outworld to the feeder colonies. I want to see how these erectors respond under pressure. I will prepare the experiment. sounds awfully eager doesn't he <laughs> let's begin with a small threat the connecting the Fusca colony now I will let ten through to start with oh here we come so some black ants just like these ones the only difference is potentially is that my ants are fully upgraded oh Set the wrong ants up here. Yeah, mine are level three because I've fully upgraded all my ants, so mine might be a little bit stronger. Let me put you guys down here. Put you as number one. There we go. Then I won't the get confused. Identified the threat and responded very quickly. Excellent. Let's see how they handle a few Ugh. more, shall we? Introducing twenty. There we go. So I have thirty-three versus their twenty. Yeah, I see mine ran off then. Oh, it died. <laughs> yes. You see it run out. It must have, uh, it had about five around it, so. It's interesting how some of them don't attack instantaneously. They just kind of linger around. We've got plenty of food, so we should be able to regenerate our numbers. Hopefully. Our eruptors have neutralized the threat to their queen. Good. Continue the experiment. Let me know the results. Don't add more than 30 ants at once, though. We don't want to harm the queen. Understood. Mm hmm So we can't have any more, unfortunately, at this stage. Mm, I wonder how they will react to a rival Oreptor colony. Introducing 40 rival Oreptor <laughs> ants. <laughs> Did you hear the pleasure in his voice when he disobeyed an order? And it's like, 40? <laughs> So happy with himself. I think my black ants are superior to these ones. I'm pretty sure in the past, um, this is on easy anyway, two or three of these ants usually can stave off an entire wave. I used to just kind of have a little group here, and as soon as they come out, they were just chewing them up like like there were nothing. Yeah, they, they do die fairly quickly. I think the more powerful ants, are potentially the black ants, or the ones that come from up here, I forget what they're called. They're the wood ants. I don't know if there's a tube in this bottom corner. No, there isn't. <laughs> mm-hmm. 50. Oh, boy. Oh, though, like I say, I don't think these ones are a challenge so much. See, that one's taking a beating of about six here. Look at them all, all on it. And it's just chewing them up how he's run off now because he was getting hurt. But he took a... They sustained beating it. Why are you guys not getting involved? Come on. There's 30 something of you. We should all jump in and have some fun. <laughs> there we go. 
Fascinating. Oh, really? Now, we can't defend inside. We can't defend here if we want to. Now, let's try 60 Raptor Ants. 60? Yikes. That is a lot. Okay, all of the ants are allegedly here. This is where having two separate groups sometimes helps because you can kind of have like a pincer movement. You can have like one face them here and then send another group this way and, and just surround them because they don't seem to move forward even though you kind of have to keep moving the um, the pheromone trail I find to keep driving them forward. I mean we're getting surrounded in a sense so there we go. <laughs> Made light work of that. It's perfect. Seeds. You're trying to bait me. Why have you dropped them? I don't really need the food, so I'm not overly bothered. Ah, it's only a few. Let me turn their food hunting off. What's this one here? Oh, the attack is turned off. No wonder they weren't. What about a combination they were attacking of when attacked. Let's start with 20 of each. That explains. Oh, here we go. This might make more sense to actually be inside. Let's drop inside. Because the holes kind of distract the ants a little bit. Oh, you guys. Why don't you... Oh. These ones might actually take those ones out by themselves. How many is there? Four. Yeah, look at that. They're making mincemeat of them. There we go. An Job done. Defense, yet highly effective. It's interesting to see the colony fight on two fronts. Perhaps we should try. Make a little bit more space here. Each. I don't want to waste my expansion. But if there's a little bit more area here, they're more likely to linger around. Wow! Look at all of these. My goodness, that is an invasion. <laughs> I think we'll be fine though. There we go. Now, they're definitely attacking now. That was my fault because I had that switched off. That explained why they were being a little bit docile. Oh, well, we've lost two so far. We've lost a couple of our workers, three. Oh, they're dropping like flies. Magnificent. Once again, our raptors triumph. Mm hmm. More seeds. Yeah, that's not a bad amount, but I'm not desperate for food right now. Thing is, when you defend up on the top, like here, if any of them get through, then your queen is susceptible to, to being attacked. Um, I mean, I prefer to be up here, but it's just something to bear in mind. Excuse me, it's giving me a chance to collect the food, but that kind of baits you in a sense. We should We should be fine. I mean, it, I think it's 50 food per ant, isn't it? So we can replace quite a few. Overwhelming assaults is incredible. There we go. And, uh, how will they handle a sustained flow of aggression? Now, what will probably happen here is you'll see a few of these break off to deal with these guys, and they will probably hold them back. There we go. That's enough. It's more than enough. So some of them will teeter off and come over this way, and eventually you'll just have a, a small kind of um, horde almost just dealing with these guys because the black ants are more annoying there we go that's what I mean, they're chewing through them like there's they're nothing, and eventually they'll probably end up here anyway, even though the pheromone marker is over here let's make things a little Ooh. more interesting shall we? enter the devil's coach horse he's playing with me now Bearing in mind, we're still having those other ants come at us at the same time. But there's probably a couple of little groups like this. Yeah. Oh, looks like we lost a few ants there, unfortunately. Quick, 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 before they go now. <laughs> Look, these guys are just... Whoops. I seem to have dropped my beetles. I hope they don't harm the little ants. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, God, these are the big ones as well. Oh, no, he's going inside. Ah! Quick, 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 quick. Oh, what? Oh, there's three of them. Oh, that is just unfair. <laughs> I'm hoping because we're level three we'll be fine, but... Yeah, let's just wait here. 
It's safer. Are the other ones coming down? Oh, they're just chewing the ones on the surface. Look, these, look at these three guys here. <laughs> Literally trying to climb up the pipe to take them out. I think these ones may struggle to keep Perhaps on top of the black ants. For now. It's actually given up. Like the food, my little pretties. There we go. How has the colony been responding? They mounted an excellent defense against 20, 25, and even 30 Fusca ants, as you suggested. Perfect. Perhaps we can provide more of a challenge for them next time. <laughs> what a fantastic suggestion. Such a liar. <laughs> Completely ignored the fact that he swarmed us, basically. Right, so we've got some uh, food to go and collect, haven't we? So now we've unlocked... Let's see how the colony grows over the next few days. Now that they have experienced battle, I expect to see a significant rise in the number of soldiers. Yeah, so we've now unlocked um, level two, which um, we can do. Um, we're only 11 minutes in. I don't know if we'll do it in this episode. Maybe we should because it's not going to be a full episode. That being said, it's probably going to take a little while to do that. So maybe I should dedicate an entire episode to that itself, maybe. But let's collect all this food. Um, is there anything else dotted around? Food stores are full. Ooh. Um, okay, we have a little bit more space to, uh, to dig. So I kind of almost feel like I should probably have the food a little bit closer to the entrance. So they've not got so far to walk, but... This is fine. And, and to be honest with you, we're going to build more ants shortly. Uh, probably the wood ants. So we'll be able to unlock that and we'll have a look at that in two seconds. Let's get all this updated. I'm not too sure where they are with adding more content to the game. I know they've, um, they've made a lot of posts on Twitter saying like, how overjoyed they are and like how popular the game has been. Uh, it'd be interesting to see because level 2 point... Is it 2.2? 2 .2? 2.2, that's the last, well, you got the challenge, but that's kind of the uh, the last part of the game as it stands. It's still early access, so it's not the end of the world. It does mean that there is more to come. Okay, how are we doing for food? Okay, we've got all of that stuff. Yeah, this is this is a lot of food. Um, you guys, mm, yeah, set you up here as well. Oh my goodness, look at them all. Um, right, so let's start working on some more ants. So if we unlock the wood ant, uh, we've got a rapid fire and a mortar ant. Um, is this just the... Oh, right, I've got to choose one or the other, that was it, yeah. So we'll take the rapid fire one. I prefer that one. And um, we've got 19 left. Can we actually do these upgrades? No. But they're the next ant that we're going to build. It'll probably talk as soon as I place these. I'm pretty sure it does. In fact, let's... Um, I didn't mean to do that. Send you back up there. Let's... Turn a lot a bit more space here. How much have we got left? Oh, we got, we got a fair amount of space. And we can add another 50 ants as well. That's something to bear in mind. Let's tunnel this out and make that a little bit straighter. I mean, we can tunnel through here, so it's easier for them to walk through. There we go. So if I'm right in thinking, if I drop one here, 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 and here, I should probably be able to upgrade them all properly, I think. Yeah, as soon as I place this, um, the game will, will start to speak because it can't help itself. Maybe not straight away, but it will. Maybe it needs one to hatch first. How many is that? There's going to be quite a few, I would have thought. The Eraptor workers have raised their first Formica Rufa ant. Incredible. I wasn't sure it was even possible. Yeah. Let's upgrade these. 
So we're going to get ourselves kind of ready for the next challenge. Um, I will have more black ants as well later on. Um, and that's that's kind of the goal right now. It's just to kind of prepare ourselves. Um, I don't know how we're doing for food. Let's get number three up here. We're probably not going to have enough food to do everything just yet. Um, but we're going to get food when we do the um, level two missions as well. So it's something to bear in mind. But the more of this we can uh, get done, the better. There we go. That should allow me to upgrade this one. So everything else here is level three. Unless I've missed something. Ah, I've not yet purchased the upgrade, so we're definitely going to have to do the missions in order to get that. Okay, that's fine. Are you guys going to come and do this? Anybody? Thank you very much. Ah, I know, it's because we're relying on those seven and they're still building. Oh, they've done them all now. I was going to say building all those as well. Oh, so we're not quite the perfect hexen because that one won't upgrade. Four by four by four by four. You'd have thought it would have been. It's slightly odd, isn't it? Hmm. Maybe it's me. Okay. So now we um now we have these. Well we will have once they all pop out of their little shell. Um you can see these little ants here. And what they do is they kind of I, I can't think. I was going to say they get up on their hind legs, but I think they do. And they bend their abdomen forwards and they start f like firing what looks like acid or something. I'm not too sure what it is, in all fairness. But um, they are quite effective at taking things out. Um, so we will we will upgrade them once we've got the royal jelly um, in anticipation for the challenge. But the rising tide and the queen of the hill... We get to use those ants anyway, so um, we're going to see them very shortly. But I think I'll probably leave them, this or I should say, I will leave that um, mission until the next episode. So we can kind of keep an episode per thing that's going on. Although some of these do take a little bit longer, so they might maybe slightly longer episodes anyway. Uh, thank you very much for watching, but until next time, as always, take care. <laughs>